I guess I was uh, lucky enough to start off as one of the first ISPs uh, in Hong Kong back in 1995. Uh, I then I was um, heading up the Internet Service Providers Association locally, and that kind of led us um, to have a central or organized you know body to um, discuss you know with the government on on internet regulations. Um, or the you know communication telecommunications uh, issues uh, among us, um, and that kind of um, opened the door to to many of the issues that we are facing today, like copyright, privacy, security, uh, and even just internet accessibility. Yeah. Okay. I think to me personally, it was the, um, the security. Uh, security issues that brought about by the internet, uh, because before we, uh, regardless of whether it's, it's individual or corporate, um, or computers were standalone computers, or even uh, they were, even if they were networked, they were they were like um, I guess limited or or um, constrained to its within its own physical reach. Uh, but with the internet, um, it moved beyond the borders of all countries. Uh, is uh, we started to have a you know um, I guess cyber life, uh, and so the security uh, of our assets, of our privacy, of our personal information, of everything uh, that we have in the physical world um, have become virtual, or you know. Have um, um, we have a separate or we have a duplicate identity or even multiple identities, uh, if you will, uh, um, uh, to protect or to you know to 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 present, and um, and that you know that af that affected us uh, beyond um, our imagination at the time. So um, something that I guess uh, f we were trying to to work on. Uh, I guess for le nearly two decades, actually, just to keep improving that, and then it's like cat and mouse chase. You know, uh, we have this issue, and then we try to close the loop, and then we have another issue. We're trying to close it, or to 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 limit the damage, and or to enhance the situation uh, by by regulations, by technologies, by by simply best practices. You know. Uh, have trying to strike that balance between the freedom of the internet or the the, the flexibility the, the internet you know activeness, creativeness of, of the internet uh, and security or the protection that that uh, we may bring about. Not in weather expert. <laughs> But I would say um, it is sunny with scattered clouds, <laughs> yeah, because I think overall the the um, I cannot even use the word future anymore. I mean, in discussing internet, because it's here, it's been here with us for 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 quite some time now. Um, but then, um, I guess how and what we are using the internet with um, is still beyond our, our imagination today. Um, but then we probably can learn from experience that uh, what we are doing or what we, you know, we have with the internet now or in the future would bring us uh, more than just, I guess, benefits. We would bring us other burdens as well, you know, like security, privacy, and all this. And that's where I meant the scattered clouds would be, you know, because the future is definitely sunny, you know, the internet is definitely sunny. Uh, um, it represents, you know, um, life, bread and butter for, for a lot of people, um, and it, it represents fortune for a lot of people, uh, but obviously, you know, since we live, or a lot of people live their lives on the internet, um, 
if it is not like balancedly or right, rightly um, governed or you know used, then um, it could create you know um, disasters for us for the for the general internet netizens. I would hope um, that the internet accessibility to be, I guess, further improved. And this, I guess, does not apply only to the, I guess, developing countries or the disadvantaged countries. Uh, um, but also, I mean, even like I was mentioning earlier to the, the Board of Trustees, um, even for major um, established cities like Hong Kong, we still have a lot of people uh, because of various um, disadvantages, they do not get to access internet as freely as as most of us can, and and I think this uh, this is simply not you know uh, fair to these people, and and I think uh, if there's any way we can improve that, it would be it would be much better, uh, and and I guess also the um, I, I, like I said um, it's also the the freedom. Uh, of using the internet for doing whatever you know uh, people want, I think is is a part of the beauty of of internet to 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 begin with. Um, um, so uh, this is something that I hope to see that can be preserved. That I guess it's not an easy question uh, because. Um, I would think the important thing is to, or important action is um, for various governments, um, if I'm speaking, I guess, uh, with the locality of Hong Kong, then <coughs> uh, of course the Hong Kong government, but also uh, because the internet is global, um, various government or stakeholders to really sit down, get together, and, and I guess, and to, to to work out those um, issues in preserving the internet as it was supposed to be, uh, and this got the useless political issues, you know, between countries and you know, or because all those things. Because uh, I think uh, a lot of issues uh, about internet privacy accessibilities. And all those they 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 are being talked about, but the effectiveness of those uh, initiatives were really hindered by by the politics of those countries, and 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 the effect is not uh, really as um, forthcoming than than it was seen. Or what's expected, so I think this is something that that you know um, that leaders, internet leaders from all over the world, should really um, think about this and 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 you know help to take away those barriers and and you know barricades and and to to really move it forward. Uh, well, I guess uh, I was. Uh, flattered, and, and I was not. Ex like, I was not expecting that. Um, we simply just did what we believe we should be doing, and and so we ended up doing a lot of activities. Uh, and just, I guess, it's partly the way um, people in Hong Kong expect things to happen. Um, they expect things to happen, you know, quickly. Uh, they expect a high quality of standards uh, from and all the works you know people do. Um, so you can almost immediately see your results. You know, if you do a poor job or you do a good job, you know, you you would not have a good turnout the next time you organize anything. Um, if you know, and then we would really give you feedback. Um, almost right away, you know, and and this is, I guess, 
also the driving force for us uh, in the local chapter that that um, we try to uh, ensure the quality of of all the events or activities are up to the you know standards of <coughs> of the target audience you know so um, we don't just organize any event we just we organize events that really uh, the attendees can can get something out of and to, to really have something to take home. You know, um, not just okay, come here and then look at and see vendors selling things or, or promoting their services, you know, uh, we try to avoid that. Um, so, uh, and, 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 and we are lucky to have, you know, a good group of people who, who help to, to build the chapters, you know, um, till we have today, you know, it's, it's not a, it, it cannot happen overnight. It cannot happen, you know, in a short period of time. So it's, it's an effort. It's an effort that, that, you know, from a lot of people to you know build up over time. The Hong Kong public, um, they, they are more. They are very picky on on on. The quality, um, they don't like anything that is too intangible. They like to really, uh, they want to, to know what they are really getting um, as a result of, well, joining any activities, uh, joining an association, um, doing anything, you know, uh, with their time. They don't want to waste their time and, and just come and, okay, we'll listen to something and then what's going on, right? And <clears throat> they don't like that. So, um, Every time when we organize anything, uh, we need to 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 get that straight and get that message out, and that's why um, we try to when we whenever we organize any any activities or we um, prepare any even responses to the government, we need to have um, direct response, direct um, answers to 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 the area of concerns. Um, we cannot just, just briefly, you know, touch on anything and then move and move on and and okay, we claim that we we we, we did something. It, it they just would not forgive us on doing that. Um, um, and of course, we are. That's why we are also affected uh, in a way by um, by the general livelihood of the of the of the. IT industry in general, ICT industry in general, because um, we cannot talk about uh, something that is too high level, such as um, internet governance per se, uh, uh, because that would not be that that would be too far for too far away for the general user. It would be uh, we they want to talk about okay. Uh, what does it really affect my job? What does it really? Why does it really related to, or relate to to um, <coughs> to 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 the work we do, to my company, to my, to the pro to my products? Okay, so that's why uh, uh, we instead of general governance, for example, we have to uh, focus on IP rights issues, you know, uh, specific legislations, things that really. Concrete, you know, um, uh, and uh, that I guess uh, would be the one of the biggest difference in compare with inter society in general. You know, which which is more global. So they have to, I guess, lift themselves up, I guess, and and, and talk about something at a high level. But then, for us, we have to be we have to dive in and and really, you know. Um, to do the work, I mean, work on the real stuff, the, the technical, the real technical stuff. Um, we have been performing well in terms of uh, membership numbers. Uh, we're performing well in terms of um, number of activities that we 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 organized. Um, it's important and. Obviously, not easy to to keep that up. Um, so, um, I guess this is something that that is always um, 
in the focus of of the board of directors of the Hong Kong chapter. Uh, how to maintain that? How to to main, especially maintain the um, the attention, the focus of our members um, to our activities, to come to our activities, uh, and then we could tend to maintain that list of quality activities, you know, um, to be you know organized um, in the future. You know, it's just getting um, getting quality, you know, speakers and 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 operating quality events is is not always it's always difficult and, and it's um and it takes a lot of effort to to make it, you know, successful. Yeah.